an old abandoned school bus until necessity led to creativity. It's now home to six members of the Aris family. While it's a shelter, it's not ideal. It leaks during rainy days and becomes unstable when it's windy. Life here is very hard. I am here because I have no income at all and have to make a plan for my children. So I'm now roaming just to survive. The Aris family is among thousands of indigenous sons who live here. Askam is a sandy, poverty-stricken remote area in the Kalahari. For local authorities, delivering services here is difficult. Residents are reluctant to move closer to towns as they are deeply attached to their roots and culture. We know that uh, there was challenges of housing. Uh, we know there is challenges of poverty. We had to look at what is the job creation initiatives that we are engaging on. Bwetes says his department will assist the Aris family to get ID documents to access grants. If anyone is willing to assist with donations of clothes and food, please contact SABC's Touching Lives. You can call 011-714-5720 or email touchinglives at sabc.co.za. Motlalipilo Marake, SABC News, Askam in the Kalahari.